Hey, I'm doing this Rob Brown, make here for Richard Mental R&B, and this is another episode of Richard TV 91. This time I'm doing another episode of Halloween Classics. This time we're reviewing Halloween, and this is the 2018 version. What happens on this uh, movie is, it starts off with these two reporters going to see Michael at the uh, psychiatric hospital. And they're asking him all these questions, and they show him this, his mask or whatever, and he doesn't say nothing. So the two reporters go to talk to Lori Stroud, and... She pretty much tells them pretty much to F off. She doesn't really give them that much information. And then she, they pay her for her interview or whatever. And she takes the money to her granddaughter. Now, her relationship with her her daughter and her granddaughter, it's her, she does a better relationship with her granddaughter, but her daughter is kind of iffy because the way she raised her and being prepared if Michael ever came back again. She taught her how to shoot and all this other stuff and be prepared for that. And she, her daughter was in her for this. Well, what happens is, is they're transporting Michael and a bunch of other uh, psychiatric uh, patients to a news facility. Bus crashes, Michael gets loose. Michael goes on killing spree. He starts killing everybody, uh, trying to find Lori Stroud. And Lori and the police officer that... Uh, help arrest Michael in the first movie because with this this 2018 version it's a different timeline from the other movies like H2O and all that that's a whole different timeline so that's not relevant to this in this timeline this is the first time Michael's done anything since he's been arrested and that was like 30 years ago so he goes on to kill his spree uh, he tracks Lori and them to her house uh, Lori's granddaughter's able to make it to her house and come to find out, Lori's house is pretty much a trap for Michael. And they get him down to the basement and they lock him in there after fighting him to get, get him down there in the first place. And then they pretty much burn the house down and Michael's supposedly dead. So that's all that really happened in this movie. If y'all have ever watched Halloween 2018 version, what y'all like about it? My question for y'all is, is Michael really dead? As always, Rob Brown, make sure you put your man on to sign out. That's GG's off. My rating for this is probably going to be a 8 out of 10. See you next time.